A silent threat, eight silent signs of fatty liver disease. Fatty liver disease happens when too much fat builds up in the liver. If left alone, it can make the liver swell and cause health problems. It can lead to liver swelling and cause issues like high blood pressure, diabetes, and problems with the kidneys and gallbladder. Over time, it can damage the liver with scar tissue, making it hard for the liver to clean the blood properly. Eating too much oily stuff, like margarine or sugary foods, can make it worse. Also, drinking too much alcohol or taking certain medicines can hurt the liver and add more fat. It's tricky because regular blood tests might not show it. Often, people don't know they have it until the liver gets really hurt. In today's video, I'll talk about 8 signs of fatty liver disease so you can recognize it and take steps to help yourself. Number 1. Right shoulder pain. Your liver, like a filter in your body, helps with digesting food and getting rid of waste. Sometimes, when the liver has too much fat in it, it can get big and swollen. When this happens, it can press on nearby nerves, causing pain that you might feel in your right shoulder, neck, or even jaw. The liver makes something called bile, which helps break down fats in the food we eat. But if the liver is too full of fat, this bile can get stuck, making the liver swell up. When it gets big, it can press on a nerve that goes to your shoulder, causing that area to hurt. Number 2. Abdominal Fat Accumulation Abdominal fat means having extra fat around your belly. It happens when there's too much fat stored inside and around the tummy area. This extra fat can make your belly look bigger and feel a bit hard when you touch it. When there's a lot of fat inside your liver, sometimes it can't hold it all, so it starts pushing outward. This makes your belly stick out more. The fat around the belly isn't just on the outside, some of it is also around your organs inside your tummy. Having a bigger belly isn't just about how it looks. It can also make things not work as well inside your body. This extra fat around your organs can make it harder for them to do their jobs properly, like helping you digest food or keeping your blood pressure steady. Number 3. Spider Veins Spider veins are small, thin veins that can look like little red or blue lines on the skin. They often appear on the legs, and they might look like a spider's web or branches spreading out from a center. When the liver has too much to do, it might not process things as well, like hormones in the body. Sometimes, this can cause these tiny veins to appear on the skin. These veins show up because the liver isn't working perfectly, and it might not be able to handle all the hormones. Seeing spider veins might mean that the liver is having a hard time processing certain things. It's like a little signal that something might be a bit off with how the liver is working. Number 4. Male Breast Tissue Development Sometimes, men might notice their chests changing, like having a small lump or feeling tenderness around the nipple area. This happens because some men might grow a bit of tissue that's similar to what women have in their breasts. When there's too much of a certain hormone in the body, it can lead to this change. The liver plays a role in managing these hormones, and if it's not working as it should, it might let more estrogen stay in the body. Finding this kind of change in a man's chest doesn't always mean something very serious. But sometimes, it can be a sign that the liver might need a bit of extra care or that there could be something else going on with the body. Number 5. Swollen Right Foot Sometimes, one foot might get bigger and puffier than the other. When this happens to the right foot more than the left, it's called a swollen right foot. It might feel tight and look bigger, and when you press on it, it might leave a dent that stays for a little while. This swelling can happen because when the liver isn't working as well as it should, it might affect blood flow. This can cause fluid buildup in the body, and sometimes it collects more in one foot than the other. A swollen right foot can be a sign that the liver isn't doing its job perfectly. It's like a clue that there might be something not quite right with how the body is handling things like fluid and blood circulation. Number 6. Itching of hands or feet. Sometimes, people might feel a strong urge to scratch their hands or feet because they feel itchy. It's like a tickling or prickling feeling that makes you want to scratch. When the liver is not working perfectly, it might have trouble handling something called bile. 
this can cause a buildup of bile under the skin, especially on the palms of the hands or soles of the feet. When this happens, it can make those areas feel itchy. Feeling itchy on the hands or feet might be a sign that the liver needs a bit of extra care. It's like a little signal that something might be a bit off with how the liver is working. Number 7, Low Thyroid Function. The thyroid is a gland in your body that makes hormones. When it's not working as well as it should, it's called low thyroid function or hypothyroidism. This means the thyroid gland isn't making enough of the hormones your body needs. Sometimes, when the liver is not working properly, it can affect how the thyroid gland works. The liver helps convert a hormone called T4 into another important hormone called T3. If the liver isn't doing this conversion well, it can lead to low levels of T3, causing low thyroid function. Low thyroid function can make a person feel tired, gain weight, have dry skin, and feel cold even in warm temperatures. It can also affect how fast or slowly their body works. Number 8. Constant fatigue or lethargy. Constant fatigue or lethargy means feeling very tired all the time, even after resting or sleeping. It's like having low energy that doesn't go away, making it hard to do regular activities. When the liver has too much fat and isn't working well, it can't process some important nutrients, like vitamins, properly. This can lead to not having enough energy because the body can't absorb these nutrients well. Feeling tired all the time might be a sign that the liver needs some help. When the liver can't do its job properly, it affects how the body gets energy from food and nutrients. Next, we will talk about lifestyle modifications to address fatty liver disease. Dietary changes. Dietary changes mean adjusting what you eat and drink to make it healthier. Changing your diet helps your body get the right nutrients and keeps it strong and healthy. Eat more natural foods like fruits, vegetables, and healthy fats. Try to avoid foods that can harm your body, like sugary snacks and processed oils. Eating better can help your liver and body work better, giving you more energy and making you feel better overall. Digestive Enzyme Supplement It's a special pill you can take to help your body break down food better. These pills contain enzymes that help your body digest food, making it easier for your stomach to absorb nutrients. If your body doesn't make enough enzymes, these pills can lend a hand, especially if your liver needs help processing fats. Diet Modifications Diet modifications mean changing the foods you eat to make them healthier and better for your body. Changing your diet can help your body work better and stay strong by giving it the right kinds of foods. Eat more healthy foods like fish, lean meats, and veggies. Try to have less sugary and starchy foods like sweets and bread. Milk thistle extract. Milk thistle extract comes from a plant called milk thistle, and it's a natural supplement. It has something called salimarin, which helps protect and heal the liver by acting like a shield against certain harmful things. It's thought to help the liver work better and may also help reduce inflammation and damage. Intermittent fasting. Intermittent fasting is a way of eating where you cycle between periods of eating and not eating. Instead of eating all day, you have specific times for eating, followed by longer periods without food. It helps the body use stored energy and supports better metabolism. For example, you might eat during an 8-hour period and then fast for 16 hours, like eating from 12 p.m. to 8 p.m. and fasting until 12 p.m. the next day. It's important to do it safely and with guidance. Apple Cider Vinegar and Lemon Juice They're natural liquids made from apples vinegar and lemon juice that people sometimes drink for health. They contain acids and vitamins that can help clean the body, support digestion, and improve overall health. People think they can help the liver, reduce fat, and make digestion better. Mixing a tablespoon of apple cider vinegar and two tablespoons of lemon juice in water and drinking it in the morning on an empty stomach is how some people use it. Always check with a doctor before trying new things. Please click like and subscribe to my channel for age over 50. Thank you for watching. I wish you safety, success, and happiness always.